All right, guys. Thought I'd try to string a video together here on this uh, Honda we got here. Now this is a 97 Accord. All right. It had some front end damage. There's a look at the uh, bumper. See all the scrapes. Actually, what happened, or at least this is what I was told, was the car was pulled onto something like a bump stop, uh, but it was extremely high and the bumper went over the bump stop but when they backed it off it pulled it all loose and then it fell on the ground and literally let's see if I can show you guys here this is the top literally drug and the marks would indicate that so it actually folded under the car and was being pushed so that's our old bumper cover we got our new one I've already test fit it and uh, I'll show you what I've done to the car and get a yep, the hood was already popped bear with me here guys sorry about the camera okay <clears throat> so as you can see this foam and stuff it's all taped up here and and that's fine it's not broke or anything like that but what happened was is this became separated from this plate and that made the bumper hang down a little bit when I put my new one on so what I did was and I don't know you see a bolt in there Let's see if we can get a light on it come on light there we go maybe Bear with me here that's it right there see that bolt right here inside there you can see maybe perhaps you guys can see or not the metals kind of pulled it's like a two-piece situation here and that bolt held on held this piece up against this plate the plate is not part of this piece so what I did was since it's all pulled apart very hard to get to uh, fixing it would have been a kind of a you know a, a bitch uh, to remanufacture the plate and straighten it all up I just welded it I just welded it to it it's nice and strong you can stand up on it I stand up on it and jump up and down we did it on both sides and that made our bumper fit perfect all right so the headlights there's no damage with that uh, we do have some damage with the uh, turn lights and these were all bent in you can see that's a piece of a headlight bracket broke uh, I'm gonna glue that and then this was all pushed in quite a bit so I've pulled all these out you know like this this one's perfect uh, this one over here not so perfect uh, yet I don't know if you can see or not there's a little dent right there and I'm gonna try and work that out uh, this one could go a little farther out maybe about right there okay but anyway we don't have any issues and what I'm going to try to do is I'm going to try to pop that down out a little bit just make it better okay and then I'm going to try to get this glue off this tape who knows how long they had this bumper cover taped on here um, this is some nasty nasty stuff but the first thing I'm going to do is paint this bumper this morning you see I got it all scuffed up and uh fit real nice and we're not going to have any issues there so I'm going to get that painted uh, so I can put the headlights and stuff back together so I'll get that done and uh, and then the next thing we're going to do we got some body damage I'm going to leave the hood alone it's full of dents but the car's full of dents there's all kinds of little dings and I guess you would call them pecker dents uh, there's a bigger one right there. I don't know if you guys can see it or not Okay, we got a rust spot right there, and I haven't decided whether or not I'm gonna fix that yet or not um, We got a peeling top We got uh, the beginnings of a peeling deck lid plus we have a little dent right here So that's a bonus uh, if it's gonna have damage. I'd rather have damage where I'm definitely gonna paint We got a little dinger right there 
and I believe I'm gonna let that go and we got a little little thing here and I can't decide if I'm gonna fix that or not I'm undecided on that one um, if I fix that then and I'm gonna paint the top of course the paint you know it's not as sharp as it was but um, I probably see how this is peeling right here I probably should go ahead and 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 hit this as well so you know we I just decided we're gonna go ahead and fix that okay and then over here my plan was it's peeling up here too as well as it has some deep scratches over here so I'm going to and we have a little spot here so I'm gonna go ahead and paint that panel there and I'm gonna stop it at the stripe okay I think I'm damn I really hate to paint that door I'm still undecided on the door we'll uh, we'll see but uh, anyway that's where we're at on this car I've got about an hour and a half two hours in it uh, with welding up all this front end taking it apart uh, trying to assess all the parts I need and and everything else um, and we're getting ready to uh, go ahead and paint the bumper here as soon as it dries we'll uh, we'll get her in here and get her painted in the meantime uh, in the meantime the black Honda is painted let's get a little quick look at that I've been collar sanding it uh, I had a hell of a time when I painted it and uh, this car's gonna look great though um, the humidity was off the chart near 100 percent and you know I just I just didn't want to wait I got a little bit more wet sanding to do I got a, you can see a spot right here and that's where I stopped back here uh, I hit this with 1500 and then I went to uh, 2500 to finish so there we go so this is almost ready to buff and this is done here so I got from the doors back around and it won't take very long to do it but we have the bumper all done up in here and the spoiler bumpers all sanded down ready to buff so that's what I'm getting ready to do right now I'm gonna go ahead and buff this while uh, our deal is drying out there and here's our spoiler and uh, yeah that's the next thing we're gonna do so let me get this uh, let me get a little further along here and uh, we'll check it out the 97 Honda Accord we'll see if we can kind of make a video of this all right guys all right guys just wanted to give you a little update it's Wednesday August the 1st now and uh, we shot our bumper yesterday and it came out just beautiful as you can see it's got some dust on it but uh, we got a great uh, great finish right out of the gun and uh, looks absolutely great and we got the car in primer so I didn't get a do any buffing yesterday on the uh, on the black one uh, so today that's what we're gonna do and uh, and then we'll come back and uh, probably get to paint this tomorrow sometime it's so hard to paint in the evening with the bugs so it just depends on how my buffing goes uh, it's, yeah so I'll get busy on that you can tell my I don't know if you guys can see it or not but you can tell where we got it in 2500 and where it's in 1500 huge difference there from the door to the fender but uh, that's where we're at so yesterday we painted our bumper for our Honda prepped it, painted it, and then we did all the body work and uh, got this one primed. And then uh, that was a full day for me. 
Well, there we go. Let me get busy. And we'll uh, see how far we get today. I hope I get that Honda, the black Honda, all done and put together. I need to uh, drive it around, make sure it's okay. And uh, I was going to take it to the junkyard down in Annapolis instead of driving my Jeep. So, hopefully we go to the junkyard tomorrow. Because uh, I need to get some parts. So that's where we're at. And uh, I'll turn the camera on here when we get some progress. Hi guys. I got the camera turned on this time. I can't believe I shot a video. <clears throat> And then have the camera turned on. How many times does that happen to everybody? What are you doing, Pink? Pink has decided to grace, uh, grace us with a visit. She doesn't come around much. She goes away for two or three days on her hunting trips. But, uh, what are you doing, Pink? Yeah. What do you have to say? Hmm? All right, so I'm reshooting this video, and uh, it was a little bit of a mail call here. And uh, as you can see, Neil, I already popped the top on my favorite soft drink, a Mexican Coca Cola. And uh, your opener worked fine, but you know, we can do that again. I think I've seen that in a movie one time where they put, he puts the top back on it and does, does one of these things and jiggles it off and oh. Uh, what movie was that? Caddyshack, I believe. All right, on with the mail call. Milrick 77, I got a set of Milrick boobs. And uh, that is a nice sticker, Rich. Thank you very much. We have Dan Electrode 68. Uh, Neil from across the pond first time I received anything from across the pond I've sent stuff across the pond but I never received anything from across the pond plus of course this which in a previous video uh, if it would have took you could have saw that and uh, then we got us a sticker from the paint pimp himself thank you very much Tommy Shoe. yes sir I will put that up I'll put all these up. Uh, you know, I'm all behind on getting all my stickers put up and all that, but I wanted to thank everybody for sending me a sticker. I love the stickers. Uh, it's great motivation for me uh, to look around and see the stickers. And, uh, yeah, that, uh, that helps motivate me, guys. So, also, while we're on the subject of YouTube channels, Okay, somehow or another, I keep hitting a button there, guys. So I don't know where I'm at on this, but uh, check out Doug at Lakeside Ranch. YouTube channel, Lakeside Ranch. Guy's got a lot of stu uh, cool stuff there. RC stuff. Uh, what else? Uh, he's got old uh, outboards. Uh, some older Johnson stuff really really cool stuff. So check out Doug at Lakeside Ranch Just like it sounds guys Lakeside Ranch All right So it's getting late in the evening. I didn't get a whole lot done today. It don't seem like today was my wife's birthday Happy birthday Lisa and uh so I didn't get a whole lot done. It's about 11 o'clock. I had a great chat with uh, Greg Porter on the phone today. And uh, I always like talking to Greg. And uh, <clears throat> buddy, I hope you get some rain out there. I hope it cools off for you. But uh, tonight, even though it's late, I'm going to buff this car. I got all the collar sanding done on it, washed it off. And I'm going to buff it up here before I go to bed. And uh, buffed up the, the uh, bumper cover already and it looks great so I'm going to get to work guys so this is take two and uh, I'm gonna stick this on the end of the video 
uh, on the 97 Honda Accord and uh, I'm going to get to work as soon as I do that so you guys take it easy and uh, we'll talk to you later thanks guys thanks for the stickers I appreciate it